What is up YouTube, it's Evoke Channel, YTV and I'm back with another episode. The beef between Jay-Z and Nas that took place in 2001 has gone down in rap history as has their respective diss songs Takeover and Ether. New York rapper Nas spoke with Final Magazine at the time of the beef and claimed that Jay-Z once told him that Tupac Shakur and DMX were not true lyricists. New York rapper also said Jay-Z claimed to be better than the notorious B.I.G. We were kicking it and he told me that he's better than being in our. And I said in the interview, which we surfaced earlier this week, I looked at him like he was crazy. Then he started telling me Memphis Bleak was a fan and that I shouldn't go at him. He predicted that Penny Seagull would never sell more than 600,000 copies. He said that Saw's money was what nature was to me. Then he really got crazy, Nas continued. He said that Tupac and DMX were not lyricists. I told him that I disagreed with him that Pac was the greatest ever, period, and that DMX really brought that back into the game. And before I move to the next topic, let me ask you guys question of the day. What you all think about Jay-Z's statement about DMX and Pac? Write your thoughts in the comments below. And now let's move to the next topic. Payback Music Group's Rick Ross is keeping it MMG all day. The hip-hop veteran goes to his Instagram story with a look at his his crew the biggest surprise even more of the company and Rocky Fresh has to be while pulling through. The MMG team is shown turning up big in the club. There's no sign of Mick Mill but you have to imagine he would be having the most fun if he was there. Wale is super pumped and loving life in the nightclub settings. You can check out pictures on the screen. So thank you guys for watching. It's Evo Channel YTV. If you like the videos and content, subscribe to the channel. Also get the notification bells and don't forget to visit website hiphoptuy.com. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.